The following program is rated TV M-A-N-O-C. It contains a big pair of nuts directly on your chin. It is intended only for mature audiences. Viewer discretion advised. What's going on, fam? It's your boy, Papa Swolio, back with some mo nuts. Hone oh, no, your chin. You ready for those nuts? I'm sweating. I just finished a sick fucking pump, and I'm here to put these sweaty nuts right on your chin. So you're welcome. Make sure also to click the links in the description down below. Subscribe to my second channel, Daily Swole Podcast, so you can get these nuts in your chin every day. Live streams every day, bitches. This video is about obesity. Now, if you've never met anyone or had any personal experience with obesity, I understand because obesity isn't a fucking word. Our girl, Madeline Georgetta, is back at it again. And I had a ton of screenshots sent my way. And actually, hysterically enough, Alan over at Every Damn Day Fitness made a video about this. I believe it was yesterday or the day before. So I highly recommend you going and checking it out. I'll actually put the link up here in the cards. Obesity doesn't fucking exist. Do you know what does exist? obesity. This beach is now putting an asterisk over the B in obesity. Obesity. What do you have against the letter B? Why didn't you block out the O? Why didn't you block out the I? What's the B got against you? What does the B know? The B knows something. You're the fucking B, Madeline. Now we're blocking the fucking word? You're putting an asterisk on the word? You shouldn't even put an asterisk on the word fuck. No word should be bleeped out or off limits. I literally mean that. You should be able to say the word cunt, twat. You should be able to say the word bitch. You should be able to say every fucking word. You know what's not intended to offend people? A medical term, obesity. You don't want to say it, Madeline. I'll say it, obesity, obesity, obesity. Obesity. What does putting an asterisk on the word do? We know what it says, it just makes you a huge pussy. You're jumping on some bandwagon that is going to sink your entire career. It was fine if you want to sell swimsuits and fucking wedge them so far up your ass crack and your puss crack, as I've documented in previous videos. You had no problem showing massive camel toe, but now you can't even show the letter B. What the fuck is going on? Just the most mindless form of censorship. Like, are you going to put a B over the word diabetes? Like, we don't want to talk about it because it's Real. And just because you are afraid of hurting someone's feelings doesn't mean it's not killing millions of people every fucking year. So get off your high horse. You're not saying anything new. You're just digging yourself a deeper and deeper fucking hole and you are bleeding fan base. You might be keeping around the weak fucking island of misfit toys, but these are people that want to be lied to. These are people that are afraid to fucking have anyone with an opinion in their circle. So enjoy, enjoy insulating yourself around a bunch of fucking jabronis. Cause I, for one, and everyone that's watching this video, the Swolnormous Nation, we're not putting up with that shit. The PC culture is fucking dying. Can't you see that? When channels like my own, with the way I talk and the way I deliver information, when these actually get attention, doesn't that signal anything? People are tired of this bullshit. People are tired of the snowflake fucking culture. People are tired of people being outraged about everything. And yeah, this video, I'm fucking raging but I'm raging on the fact that you're afraid to write or type. You're not even writing with your hands. You're typing the word and you put an asterisk over the B. Who is that offending? Like you say the word obesity, it's a medical term. There's research, just piles and piles and piles of research about obesity. It exists. Write the fucking word. You're not offending anyone by writing a medical term. Like, I almost feel like I have to convince you that this is real. It's the parody of itself. This is like me trying to convince you that the Easter Bunny actually exists. That Santa Claus is fucking real. Like, this chick actually put an asterisk over the B in obesity. Obesity. Oh, not offending anyone now. Let's talk about obesity. It's not a swear. I'm not saying fuck. I'm not saying cunt. I'm not saying twat. Madeline, I'm not talking about your camel toe that you flaunt. For someone that has a swimsuit line where 99% of your pictures are of your fucking ass, for someone who flaunts their body to make money, you flaunt your body to make money. 
Those bathing suits are ugly as shit. They're not selling themselves. They're selling because, wow, if I wear this, maybe my ass will look a fraction as good as Madeline's. So they're buying your product. You've made so much money from people buying your product for you showing your ass cheeks and wedging your swimsuits up your asshole. That's how you've made money. And now you're criticizing and trying to shelter and trying to be righteous and stand up on a fucking pedestal and defend people that are obese, a medical term that have a lot of issues coming in the very near future for them that are shortening their lifespan, that are putting themselves in an extremely high risk category for major fucking diseases. What do you have to say about that? Why not actually help those people lose weight the healthy way and then you'll actually be empowering them to live a better life. Stop sheltering people and stop putting asterisks over fucking words. I guess the moral of this story is don't be a dumb twat. We go from humble to flexing, you DM, I'm texting, she hit me right back I'm on the move, I'm not stressing, the king to these peasants, you know that's a fact Y'all hate the press, y'all elect them, a press for 11, I gave them a stack I use these words as my weapon, a demon obsession, we killing the pack We go from humble to flexing, you DM, I'm texting, she hit me right back I'm on the move, I'm not stressing, the king to these peasants